does butternut squash last all winter? That is the question and I'm gonna answer it today. So I have this butternut squash and I bought it in September. Quite honestly, I forgot about it. My son was in the hospital quite a bit and it's just been sitting on my counter just waiting to be used. So I bought it in September, it is now March. So this butternut squash has been here for six months. It really, it looks good. I mean, it still looks good. The rind is still pretty solid. So I think it's good. I am going to cook it and we're gonna find out if butternut squash truly lasts all winter. I'm gonna go throw this in the oven. All right, just got my butternut squash out of the oven. I'm gonna be honest, the, uh, the rind looks a little bit, little bit suspicious. So we've got all these little like bubbles. So I usually cook the really any winter squash about part way, about 20, 30 minutes. This is a pretty big one. So I cooked it about 30 minutes and that really helps to soften up the rind. And then it is so much easier to slice. Look at that. So easy. All right, so down here where it starts to get bigger, that is where the seeds are. I like to cut that off separate. Also gives me a flat surface to be able to cut away this rind so much easier. And you know what? The inside, the inside of the butternut squash, it really looks good. It really looks, really looks edible. You see all that steam coming off. If this was a fresh butternut squash, this would all be pretty solid. And as I get down a little further away from the stem, it looks like it's a little bit more solid. These last few little pieces look pretty normal. But pretty solid all the way, all the way through. I'm gonna dice these up. I'm just gonna take the butternut squash that I got. It's actually almost cooked all the way through. I'm gonna go ahead and roast it. So I'm gonna throw some um, avocado oil on it and then some salt and pepper. Just gonna spread it on this cookie sheet. And put some salt. And some pepper. I'm gonna go throw this in the oven on 400, really just until the ends start to get caramelized. And then I'm gonna try it. All right, my six month old butternut squash is out of the oven. All right, looks good. It smells good. Let's try it. Tastes fine. I have no problem with this. I would totally give this to my kids. Does butternut squash last all winter? I'm gonna say yes. Um, mine lasted for six months. It tastes fine. I'll tell you tomorrow if I got horribly sick from it, but it looks fine, it tastes fine, it smells fine. I have no problem using this, giving it to my kids. Uh, so I've had mine for six months. Maybe if I'd uh, used it a little sooner, it would have had a much better yield. Overall, you know, I'm perfectly happy with this. It's really nice that I was able to use this six months later. Um, I mean, not very many vegetables that you can keep on the shelf for six months. So overall, yes, 
butternut squash, it looks like it does last all winter. Um, you may not get quite as much as you originally, as you originally hoped. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to click like and subscribe to my channel so you don't miss out on any new videos.